translation of this is always at the most impeccable timing or bad timing. For the Fire Brigade of Flames, finally translated chapter 139. The anger and Methan had to bring you to it. The White Hoods has appeared, as it turns out that Sharon is, is intending to guard Inken. Because uh, one of the reasons why he's always nowadays at Homer's feet is because there's always needs someone strong to guard the fire pillars. But Homer is such a uh, unpredictable that it doesn't happen. It also turns out we meet uh, the maid or uh, Ritsu or something like that. Meaning that they will have more than one bodyguard than Sharon, who says she will protect uh, Inka while Sharon tries to take the other pillar. So, uh, well, Sharon tries to attack the Snake Man, and of course, the Snake Man's abilities have no effect on Sharon given his very highly advanced second generation, and they even manage to capture the young boy as they fight. And then, um, as uh, Haume sees the different pillars of destruction, she's still being excited by the adventure. Just then, uh, the puppet master tries to attack uh, the Eighth Brigade, but uh, gets more, in but gets into s strange trouble when Haume just suddenly destroys the puppets just like that, revealing that her electric powers are very highly advanced like that. We also meet Arrow again. It seems that uh, how may uh, no. It seems that Arrow actually oh no Arrowette or whatever she, her name was called actually survived the cave in very long time ago. The only difference is she her body seems to be very hugely covered this time. Are you is it possible she's not wearing so much underneath there anymore? And it's also um, and it also. Uh, Seems she has become more reserved and has a scar on her face now. So, well, how may mocks uh, the puppet mistress, but she, um, as uh, the others prepare to fight again, so the puppet mistress shows a new doll. She says it's the new doll of the punishment, as she shows a uh, immense amount, uh, an immense doll. Bigger than any doll she has shown before. Next chapter is appropriately called Catfight. <laughs> Are we gonna see the ladies fly? That's basically this chapter. Nothing too spectacular. I mean, it's. I can agree, it's satisfying to see the Snake Man attacks not having an effect, but I hate Sharon too. And Home is still being so very excited about the death and destruction. But are you telling me the White Hoods is gonna get in the way with another pillar? Ugh, that kind of despair is a bit annoying. So you can give me a false if you have any.